What's going on guys? In this video I wanted to show you how you can uh, read multiple analog voltages with your ESP8266. So this is a board that I made that has four I square C analog to digital converters. So as you can see in my circuit I have connected three potentiometers and you can connect four but I'm only connecting three because I don't have a fourth a fourth one that I can use. So uh, I've connected these three potentiometers to the analog inputs on the board and I am able to read the values using a Lua program that I wrote. So let me go ahead and change the values of the uh, potentiometers and you should be able to see the values change on the output of the screen. So I'm, right now I'm changing A2, so I have turned it all the way up, so you can see that it went all the way up to 1020. A, uh, that's a digital value, so that is a max value that, uh, that the analog to digital converters can read. So it's a 10-bit converter, that's why it goes to up to 1021. Let me go ahead and turn A1, so you can see that that value is now increasing. So I turned it up all the way to 1020 again. So that is equivalent to 3.3 volts. Let me go ahead and turn the other potentiometer. And you can see that that one is also now 1020. So I will post a link to where you can buy this board as well as the code for the board and the schematic. So this is the schematic that I'm using right now. And the code will be in a GitHub page for you to use. So this is my GitHub page where I will have the code and I actually have several examples so the example that I'm showing you right now is the read multiple converter so as you can see all you have to do is set up the uh, module and if you want to read from A0 you just do the read 0 if you want to read from the uh, pin A1 then you just do the read 1 so these are the uh, that would be the 0, 1, 2 and 3 inputs where you can read from. Additionally, I also created an Arduino library for those of you who like to program your ESP with Arduino sketches. So this is a library for that and I will be posting the links to this code as well as uh, I also have links on how to how to use NodeMCU or how to burn NodeMCU firmware to the ESP and I will also have a tutorial on how to burn Arduino sketches directly to your ESP so that you can program the ESP using the uh, Arduino libraries that you're familiar with but without needing an Arduino so that's it for this video I hope you learned something new thank you for watching